Well, hello again, Bible fans. Um, I'm just going to do a quick review on Rewind that uh, I'm going to do to this uh, New King James version of the Bible. And this is an edition that uh, this ministry through the Bible uh, radio uh, did. And uh, this is, as you can see, a paste uh, down cover. And um, I think this is um, big skin. Leather. Uh, this was, uh, I can't remember how much, I think it was about 8 euros, 8 euros or something like this, around 10 dollars by the, at the time. This is genuine leather. Uh, but it is a uh, cardstock, this is a paste down uh, cover, and uh, it is a, a reference uh, version. This is the Holy Bible, New King James Version, Slimline Reference Edition, Center Column References, Translation Notes, Significant Textual Variants, Concordance and Maps, Words of Christ in Red, Through the Bible Radio Network, Pasadena, California, and uh, well, just wanted to show you, uh, this is the Bible that I'm going to do a rebind, and uh, so here we have the rebind that I did to this slimline New King James version of the Bible in red uh, gold skin with uh, black inner liners in calf skin. A very nice and soft uh, 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 leather indeed. It's edge line uh, with red and sheets on top of it. And uh, this is a bit of a, to show you my corner work there. This one I did some tooling on top of the cover. You can see there. And the spine is black, it doesn't have any lettering because I wasn't sure whether to give it away and put my name on it or just uh, keep it for myself. So I decided in this, this uh, occasion not to do anything there and leave it as it is. And uh, this is the same Bible as I was uh, talking to you about earlier on. There you have it. And the font is uh, pretty decent. It's an 8.5 uh, more or less uh, size, very dark uh, and consistent. Now the paper is not great. It's not uh, an excellent paper, but it is thin, and this is a, a budget Bible, really, so you cannot expect it to be excellent, but it is decent. And it is a very good uh, Bible for uh, throwing to the car or take it into anywhere, basically, with you. Now, let's take a look at the, le the red lettering. You can see here, it's a pretty dark, and uh, it doesn't fade away. I think it's a very good uh, red with uh, references in a central column right there. I think it's really nice. Uh, it comes with a pretty decent concordance. It's just there, it's not huge, but it's there for helps. Some uh, personal study notes, extra pages there, one, two, three, four, five, six. They're lined. Now this is a very thin paper, so you will have to use one of those uh, uh, Pigma Micron pens. This is a 05, which is for underlining, but you can get them for 01 uh, for writing, which are very uh, excellent. I think I do have one here to show you. Yeah, that's the one there, 01. So you don't have a problem with uh, bleed through or anything like it. It comes with a few uh, full color maps. They're very good. They are thicker than the paper used in the Bible. This is just a kind of thicker car stock paper with a bit of glossy finish on top of it. And here is the back of the Bible. There's a few blank pages for extra notes, the end sheet, and again the cover with its uh, corner work there. You can see it there. Awesome black leather and uh, this red goat skin is amazing. I really like it. So it is very flexible. You can see you can turn it, you can twist it, 
it's very flexible you can see and uh, its size is uh, also nearly hand size this is a uh, eight inches tall and it is eight and, a, and five and a half uh, wide uh, thin line very very nice uh, font 8.5 I think you can't go wrong with this type of Bible. Anyways, that's a review for today. I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it. Please subscribe and like if you haven't done so. Talk to you soon.